it's funny how everything comes full circle. So I'm super excited because this video is in collaboration with Scentbird. They are sponsoring this video today, so thank you so much for that. I know you heard the word sponsor, but just wait, just wait. Before this came about, I actually pitched a collaboration idea to them. I don't know if they remember. It was actually a few years ago, um, but I never got a response back, so it's just so funny how everything just kind of comes full circle. But what is Scentbird? Scentbird is actually a monthly subscription service, and you get a new perfume every month. They have men and women's fragrances. They have things, everything from Tom Ford to Prada to Gucci. And actually, this time around, they have skincare. So, like I said, I've actually tried them before, and I did use my own money back then. Not this time, I'll be honest. But um, I actually tried the Tom Ford perfume, and they say it's a 30-day supply now. I made mine last. I'm not somebody that will spray five million sprays of perfume on like one and done for me. Like I like it, you know, to be subtle and light. I don't want to be bathing in perfume. So the first time I tried Scentbird, what appealed to me was, I'm not gonna lie, the price because I don't know about you guys, but like when you're shopping for perfumes, especially in like a department store, it can be a little bit overwhelming because they have so many scents and they do have like the little coffee beans for you to smell everything, but it can still be overwhelming. Like I don't think that completely, that doesn't completely reset it for me. And then plus how it smells, like if you spray it on one of the strips versus how it smells if you let it settle on your skin and really vibe with your body chemistry might be different. Also, nobody wants to be badgered all day by, you know, the salespeople trying to sell you the most expensive fragrance in the store, you know. So with Scentbird, you can really try it before you buy it. Because this video is in partnership with Scentbird, I do have a 30% off code, so if you use the link down below, you will get your first month for $10. So let me show you how it works. So if you head on over to Scentbird.com, you can kind of see the rundown of how everything works. You pick a scent, they give you what's supposed to be just a one-month supply, but you can make it last longer, and then you can cancel your membership at any time. And if you don't know where to get started, they do have a nifty little quiz that you can take and kind of get an idea of like your general scent profile or kind of recommend things that you would like. And if you already have perfumes that you like, you can enter those in. It gives you an option to enter up to three, and they can give you recommendations based on things that you already like as well. I got to select three fragrances. It came in a package like this. Is this velvet? So it's gonna come in a little velvet case like this. And then your perfume actually comes in a tube like this. So let me show you a little close up. So to use the fragrance, you screw it up like that and then you, Ooh. okay, Ooh, one spray. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. All right, so that's it. And if you wanna see which fragrance is in the tube, you can simply just take it out like this. So look, hold and just pull it out. Oh. So that was just one of the fragrances I chose, Selva de Brazil by Ber, Ber de West. I don't know. I know you guys are like, what do you mean you don't know? I chose based on the descriptions there. I chose two that I've never tried before based on the descriptions. Like I personally like, Musky smells, I like uh, smells with a hint of sweet, you know, I like to smell clean, fresh. So I decided to step out on faith and try Oddity by Rag and Bone, and this is a no for me, dog. No. Mm. This is, mm, I don't know. I, you know, I wanted to try something new, but I also wanted to play it safe and get something I knew I would love. This is Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue. Everybody has smelled this before. It's nice and light and clean smelling, perfect for spring or summer. You know, we can just slide it in our purse and go. But hey, that's it. I just wanted to pop in and share this with you guys. In the comments down below, tell me, what is your favorite fragrance? Do you like more floral smells or more fruity smells or more musky smells? And if you have any perfume recommendations, leave those down below so I can know what to try next. And as for always, thanks so much for watching, you guys. Bye.